Okay, so welcome back. In this video, I'll be talking about closing the handle. So in our previous video, we have written some content into our file. So you have learned about create file, set file pointer, and write file, correct? But you still need to do one more thing after writing your contents or reading contents of a file and that is to close the handle. So to close the handle, you simply push the file handle and then call close handle. So why do we need to close the handle? So remember that handles are limited resources that occupy the memory. So keeping a handle will take up storage and the information such as thread information, user time, kernel time, thread ID, etc. Okay? It is just a good practice to close handles. So you may be wanting to ask, what will happen if we don't close the handle? So the answer is nothing. So you can simply not close the handle, but it will leak that handle. Also, when you exit the process, then Windows will automatically close that handle. Okay? So that is all for closed handle, and I hope to see you again next time.